Hi single Pisces people, this is your monthly love tarot cards reading by Emma for the month of June 2022. Alright, I'm gonna draw four cards. Five of Swords. The Emperor. King of Wands. And the Four of Swords. Page of Swords, your influencing energy. Okay. Five of Swords with Temperance. The Emperor with a Five of Pentacles. King of Wands with the Hierophant. And a Four of Swords with Queen of Wands. Page of Swords with Magician. Look, this isn't bad, this is lovely energy. Page of Swords, it's very young energy, brings information, brings news, brings clarity. Okay, now you know. This energy of Page of Swords somewhere in May, okay, came towards you and it changed your mind in a very positive way. Since you've got this information, your realization now, nothing stands on your way, now you have everything, now it's clear to you, now you can create, now you can do, now you can make it, whatever that was on your mind. This piece of information was crucial for you to complete it. So from that point, you can do, you can make it, you are sorted. In that sense, this energy is from earlier on, very present this month for you. Now, with the Five of Swords, this is a nice energy, some sort of win you did have, but you are winning something, you are getting something which many people wanted, okay? You're not only one contender for this prize, there were other people, and you got it, you got it, you want it, you, you have it, you are visible out there, you are the winner, but there are other people, okay, who are feeling very much let down, or as a loser, or you see what I'm saying, who are not really happy. Now, with temperance energy within you, it says you are very balanced, you patiently waited for something, okay, you didn't rush yourself up, you, you didn't rush yourself up, um, you didn't rush yourself up and I really believe that is the reason why you got this prize, why you got what you wanted because you've been very patient, you allow things to develop, you monitored things around, how they're developing, how people are behaving, what are they talking, you see what I'm saying, you followed the whole situation, you've been very patient and you've got that what you wanted. I don't know, that it was some prize down there, something you wanted, and you've got it. First week of uh, June. Now look, with the Emperor and King of Wands, we can talk Aries person, strongly features Aries person for you here, um, Pisces. Now, Five of Pentacles is feeling poor, feeling abandoned. Now, this Aries person is very strong. It's a lovely energy. In a way, you can rely on the strength of this person. Authority figure, big decision maker. This person will never do anything against you. But in order to do something which is really good for you, will take over, complete your life, complete your decision-making power. You cannot make decision for yourself, okay? Okay, I will make decision for you. This is what I say. That how it's supposed to be. That's the best for you. And really, Pisces, perhaps that is the best for you. It's only that the whole time this person undermines you. You feel very poor, abandoned, neglected. This energy makes decision, has a right to make decision. Feels like that. I am making decision, that's normal, that's accepted. Why would anybody complain if I make the best decision? If I am the most intelligent, most capable one, <laughs> the emperor, supreme one. As I said, it could be that all the time is doing something, constructing something, which is really best way for you. You couldn't do better yourself, but you are ignored. You are totally ignored. It that sense energy with this emperor. And I think it's just like that because you feel very poor yourself, Pisces, this time, this second week of June. Look, much better third week. Now you are with the Hierophant, very intelligent, very patient energy. It's believer, it's a faithful person, believing now in that what this person says. Now at this point, third week of June, you understood just that what I told you, whatever this person, this Aries person said, this emperor said, okay? 
It's the best way for you. Now that's your understanding. It's really the best way for me. This can produce the best outcome for me. Trusting, believing now in this person. Let this person do. Let this person decide. Because now this person, Aries again with King of Wands, but exceptional creator. Now this is authority figure who begins to make structure, who plans it thoroughly, puts the foundations. But now with this energy, King of Wands, but this very same person is doing it. And now everything is doable. Everything is possible. There is no obstacles here. This is very confident energy. And you are trusting. You overgrow this energy of... Um, of left alone, abandoned, unappreciated. You see what I'm saying? You overgrew that. You become faithful. Okay? You believe in that what this person said. Because it is really the best way forward. Really something which can be created, which is very exciting, which can be done, which is most important end of the day. You are beginning to believe into this person. Um, now, third week of June, Queen of Wands energy within you, being jolly, being happy with that what is happening. Now, you do understand what is happening, what is creating, but you do have it in your hands right now. Okay, last week of June, you are finally having it in your hands. Now, you can do it. It was somebody else's idea, this Aries person perhaps, but now, end of the month, you are having it in your hands. You are doing it. You are creating it. Oh, you are doing it easily with the joy with fun you don't have doubts with this energy you don't have fears you are just going for it you know what you are creating in your future and you are doing it could be that we all the time talking relationship with this Aries person oh but then this person is very dominant okay you don't even like it the second week of June but then you begin to understand that this person is something special you can create life with this person you can create future with this person you you can create business career everything you know is possible you and this another one this Aries person everything is possible for two of you in that sense perhaps feelings are developing for you um, this month Pisces though look uh, with a four of swords energy out there sleeping energy things are not happening clarity is needed decision is needed some guidance is needed it's a, just a period of pause everything is prepared everything finally works for you you do understand you are into it but for some reason it doesn't happen now this month end of the month perhaps it will happen later on maybe as i said just a pause rest and relax and recuperate wait for some clarity, wait for something. You see what I'm saying? For whatever reason, things are not happening really out there. Things are not creating out there now, end of the month. Perhaps it's simply date. We will do it from 1st of July, 1st of August. You see what I'm saying? Maybe just something like that because I don't see worries about this energy, which can be worrisome. Being that is a sleeping energy, energy without clarity, without movement. You see what I'm saying? That's why I think it's something expected something planned, something you counted on. So you don't worry, you are excited about what you're going to create, about relationship with this Aries person or about your career or something. You are definitely ready to create something, to do something, to make this relationship. You are trusting it now. Enjoy it, Pisces.